Welcome back! Today I'm going to teach you how to create custom scoring events in Frosty Editor for PVZ GDB2. First, open the online folder, scroll down, open persistence, single click scoring, and open PVZ scoring. Add a new item to scoring types, open the scoring types, then scroll to the bottom. Click these three dots on your new item, create new, and select the scoring type data. Open your new item, and for measuring, I'm going to find the stat event that is buff applied X as Y. In this case, param X will be the buff applied, and param Y will be the character used. So go to stat categories. Open buff categories, I'll open root base categories, and item 2 will be goop. Remember this GUID. So go back to PVZ scoring, assign buff categories here, and find the buff data that has that GUID, and assign it. Next, I'll scroll down here, open kit categories. Open root base categories, the first base subcategory, open those base subcategories, and I'll open item 3, which is comper. Remember this squid as well. Go back to PVZ scoring, assign kit categories here, and assign the kit data with that squid. For the description SID, I'll just make it gooped. After that, add an item to bucket scores. Open it. And change the bucket to the scoring bucket of your choice. For me, it'll be XP. Also set the score. And check these two boxes. Lastly, for the identifier, go up to the previous item, copy its identifier, paste it here, but change the last number by 1. Then we'll save the project and call it goop xp. Let's launch the game to see if our custom scoring event works. Alright, I've picked a chomper, and I'm going to go goop a brown coat. And there we go, I got some XP for gooping them. Just a heads up, activating any of these custom scoring events online will cause your game to crash. But with that aside, thanks for watching, and thanks for all the tutorial suggestions.